Hi, this is Fiona here from the St. James Children's Program. I know we're not in church this week, so I thought I'd welcome you into my living room so that we can have a bit of our children's program for you. I know we're in the season of Lent at the moment and that you've all been collecting for your Alleluia eggs. Hope you've still been doing it regardless of what's happening. Now, can you remember how many of these we should have put in this week? We should have another. How many purple ones? One, two, three, four, five, six, and the special gold set one for Sunday. Now remember, when you sit in your quiet place, that we need to light our candle and say, God is here. God is near. And once we put our sequins in, we can sing our song together. Perhaps you might like to join in with me. God is with us. God is with us. Yes, we know. Yes, we know. God will always love us, God will always love us. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Amen. Now what? You might not have a prayer stone at home, like the one that we use in children's program, but perhaps you can find a nice stone on the beach if you don't have a prayer stone already. We found this one a while ago, and it's really good to use. And it's sometimes nice to be able to sit in a quiet place and just think about other people and how you can be praying for them with God. Hopefully you also remember that we're still praying for our prayer tree, for our AAW woman as well. I'm going to post another video after this, which takes you through the Lord's Prayer, something that Abel did a couple of weeks ago. I hope you enjoy this. And in the meantime, we'll get in touch every week until we can see you again in church. Blessings to you all. Hello St. James Children's Program. A couple of weeks ago, Abel talked to you about the Lord's Prayer, and we thought now that you're at home, it might be really nice to go over this again, in case you want to use it. There was once someone who told the most amazing stories. People followed him everywhere. One day someone asked him, Who are you? And he said, My name is Jesus. His friends saw that he was always praying. He prayed early in the morning. He prayed late into the night. He prayed for his friends. He prayed for those who didn't like him very much. He prayed for children. He prayed for those who were sick. One day when Jesus was praying, his friends said, Jesus, teach us to pray. This is the prayer that he taught. Our Father, who art in heaven, your heavenly Father loves you more than you could ever imagine. He is the best Father. He cares for you so much that he wants you to call him Abba, Daddy. He loves you even more than a mother hen loves her chicks. Hallowed be your name. The Heavenly Father is holy. That means he is all that is good, all that is light. Hallowed, holy be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Your Heavenly Father has spread his love to every corner of the world, north, south, west, and east. There is no part of the world that he doesn't care for. There is no part of the world that he doesn't want us to care for, and he wants us to spread his love to those we meet at school. Give us this day our daily bread. 
Your Heavenly Father provides us with what we need. Our daily bread is not just the toast we have for breakfast or the honey sandwich we have for tea. It's everything we need. Friends, family, homes. Clothes to keep us warm, food and love to nourish us. And forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Your Heavenly Father knows that we don't always get things right. We do and say wrong things. When we ask him, he forgives us. Because we are forgiven, he helps us to forgive others when we get hurt. Save us from the time of trial and deliver us from evil. God knows that there are things that make us stumble and fall. There are grey areas when we are not sure whether we are doing right or wrong. Our Heavenly Father keeps us on the right track as we look to Him for His help. God has given us the sign of the rainbow to remind us that He will never ever turn His back on us. He will never ever let us go. For thine is the kingdom. We praise God for his love which lasts forever. The power and the glory from the beginning of time with us today forever and ever. Amen. So let's go through that one more time, this time with the words, so that you can remember the prayer again at home. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial, Deliver us from evil, for thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours now and forever. Amen. Blessings with you all this week.